It's Nick Cannon Radio. We got True Queen in the building. Someone with over 15 million records sold worldwide. Several number ones. The stats, we can go on and on and on. But she here, the one and only Miss Ashanti. Hey. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. What do you want your legacy to be? What do you want to be known as? Um, just as a very unique businesswoman, you mm. know, that came in the game learning in front of right. millions of people and Facts. critics Facts. before the times of technology, growing and empowering women. Yeah. You know, it's really hard in this industry, you already know. Facts. You know, just as a female to be taken seriously, you know, um, me being a writer, writing my own records. Yeah, because I was going to tap into that. A lot of people don't give you the credit for that. Like, and I was feeling like nowadays it's like, yo, you plug one artist with this song and then you right. know, see what happens. And then you you only really hear one record from right. that artist. So right. like they, get, they ride that one record forever. Like, not only do you have a catalog, but even as a writer, you got hits under your belt mm -hmm. to where, you know, when they when it's all said and done, they're like, yo. Ashanti's pen game is crazy. I appreciate and, and, it. And came in like right in your first joint. That definitely doesn't happen. Like, even I remember being, I, I had to fight my label to let me write on my own project, wow. even as like an MC, for you to kind of jump in as, as young as you were, and not only to pen hits for others, but to pen your own first hit. And then to keep that thing going, that's that's to be commended. Like, I appreciate that. Yeah, and, and I think people don't people don't think about that because we are in this ADD generation where everything mm -hmm. is just so like, yo, it's up to Today is going tomorrow Absolutely. to be a legacy artist like that and to be able like even to like when I'm DJing I drop I, I could do a whole Ashanti set <laughs> facts and like the, the girls sing every single word from all ages you know what I mean because yeah. now the girls is 21 in the club all the way to uh -huh. 31 they rock it <laughs> and and to be a part of that that has to still feel special knowing that you're still out here active at it it is such a blessing honestly you know sometimes i see a crowd and it'll be a mother duo a mother daughter duo yeah, you yeah, know yeah. what i'm saying and it'll be it's so bizarre to me i did something in um i think it was denver it was some kind of juneteenth one of those kind of things and i kid you not this girl she couldn't be more than 15 years old passed out crying like crying yeah you know what i'm saying that's like real. singing that, records and power. <laughs> i met her backstage and i'm like you wasn't even born when my record came <laughs> out you know what i that's mean crazy. but it's just amazing because her and her mom was my exact age oh wow and her and her mom were just rocking out together that's and that so dope. feeling is just like amazing that's you know so what I mean? dope and one thing i can say is speaking of moms like from the time I very first met you to to this day, you've been so family oriented. Your mom, your sister have always been by your yeah. side. You're allowing your sister to work with you so closely and you yeah. guys working together on your clothing line. Tell Absolutely. me a little bit about that. Well, it's by Pretty Little Things. So Ashanti by Pretty Little Things? <clears throat> yes, I okay. did a bathing suit line with them. Okay. Um, and the reviews have been amazing. They sold out in almost everything. Um, what I love, and I've just been reposting a lot of women on my um, Instagram story because the, the love has been like amazing. The That's fit, dope. the way that it, it just, it's an empowering kind of a line. Right, so right. we got the plus size, we got the curvy ladies. Okay, because you know the they all like, you guys forgot about the BBW. Right, and like, we got the BBW, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We go from size like zero to 24. So right. we have everyone covered. You need to do one of them carnival outfits. And hey, listen, listen, me and Umar have another conversation <laughs> coming up. That what needs to happen. <laughs>